banya na banya. Ay, shamyon, ay, fit, bifigit, paya fufuse la, paya fit, fit. Yeah, no, we're very excited. Uh, since the previous shoot, we've renewed the contract for another four years. Uh, building the brand of Cecil Banyana Banyana has been good. Uh, many partners, you know, in sponsorship, they generally just drop off the cash and, and, and they move away. Where Cecil is actually gets involved. It's something other than football. I'm doing photo shoots in all kinds of clothing and a lot of makeup which our football players aren't used to. Coming here up, uh, away from our soccer and stuff, it's a nice feeling because you get to do the makeups, get into different kind of clothing. What we got today is exposing the Banyana Banyana team to something that they're not entirely used to every day when they go on the field. You know, normally it's soccer boots and soccer kit. We've made shoots from um, the players and myself in some different gear. But it's great to have nice pictures with professional people who know what they're doing. To see the, the change, you know, with the, with the wardrobe and, and, and the design and everything that, that, that the guys have come up with. It's, they don't look like the same players and I think this, this shoot is certainly going to make a lot of people see a different uh, Sasol Banyana. We've created a new Sasol Banyana Banyana supporter song that's launching very soon. Uh, we've turned it into ringtones, so we're really getting behind the team. They've qualified for the Africa Women's Cup. Uh, we wish them all the best for that. And I'm sure that this shoot will also be in the Destiny magazine in August for Women's Night. <laughs> actually for for having this and you know trying to get women's football out there obviously the next step for them is to finish in the top three in the all africa women's cup if they finish in the top three they qualify for the women's cup and then they will also uh, which is in canada next year in 2015 and they will also qualify then to be in the olympics in rio 2016. S safa has um, hand in a bit or they're preparing a bit to uh, host the 2019 Women's World Cup. So obviously we will work towards that and we will make the plans on the longer term to get under 20, under 17 players, um, get them at the level to compete at the World Cup. And that will be fantastic because if South Africa will host the Women's World Cup, it will be huge, it will be massive and it will be one big party of women's football. Over there.